Today we have for you a December 2005 BMW X5. It's a sport, it's black with black leather interior and is the very, very last of the series. It's got memory electric seats, satellite navigation and a panoramic sunroof. The car drives very well, it's got an excellent service history. It's done 131,000 kilometres which is absolutely nothing on a diesel. These 3 litre diesels have a huge amount of power and good towing capacity. Being a newer model it's got automatic headlights as well which is good. It's got dual airbags, side airbags, all the wheels are in very good condition. And the paint is in very good condition also, for, especially for a black car. All the leather interior is in great condition also which is fantastic. The car's got plenty of registration on it. It does have parking sensors. These diesels are very good on fuel. It's got the two-way tailgate. The seats fold down. It's got your rear parcel shelf, which is great. It really is a lovely car. Yeah, all the alloy wheels all the way around are very good. Especially the back left sometimes gets quite a bit of gutter ash. It's got tinted windows. So yeah, to me, it sort of seems to tick all the boxes. Black with black, tinted windows, the sport with the bigger wheels. It just looks fantastic. It's got three keys to the car, two remotes, and one spare plastic key. Here's all your log books. It's been serviced at a BMW, and after that it was at a, a specialist, but at the same specialist from brand new, which is fantastic. So as you can see here, we've got your BMW service history. Then it goes to 3D Automotive, right through. So last service was 124,000 uh, uh, Ks, I should say, which is fantastic. It does have climate control as well. These have hill descent control, and as I may have mentioned, it's got parking sensors, and it looks like it's got tire pressure monitors as well. It's getting harder and harder to find these X5s in good condition, especially in black. And this is a lovely example. Another thing I'm finding is a lot of the diesels tend to have a huge amount of kilometres. I'm starting to see them with 200, 240, 280. So in my opinion, this is still a very low kilometre car in great condition. So if you are looking for an X5, whether it's a, a petrol, a diesel, please come and have a look at this one and take it for a drive. It just drives beautifully. So we're the old timer centre. We're located in Markville and we 